Hello everyone out there in YouTube land and welcome back to my channel for a super amazing exciting video. Are you ready? Are you ready? So I I had like a tough day at work but really every day is a tough day at work and I come home and I have this parcel waiting for me when I when I open the door and this parcel comes all the way from the United Kingdom from my super subscriber Claire Davis hi Claire and and thank you thank you so much for the box I haven't opened it yet I'm gonna open it on camera so let me tell you guys out there in YouTube land how this started so I decided to do a giveaway of swords a giveaway um, and I really just gifted a candle and some Bath and Body Works stuff to Claire because she's amazing and sweet and wonderful so I sent her some stuff and I told her I didn't want anything in return but she is so kind-hearted and so amazing that she decided that she would send me a gift in return and that's what this is so I'm so excited I'm so excited but I have to be honest though um, I did cheat a little bit because not only let me tell you guys out there in YouTube land not only is it a huge pain in the butt to send something to United Kingdom because it is so expensive but you have to fill out a customs form that they stick to the box that has everything you have to write everything that's in the box how much it weighs the value and all that other stuff it's like what they think you're gonna send so I kind of have an idea of what's in here because of course the giant customs form is on the top but that doesn't make it any the less exciting so it's always fun to get a gift, but it's even more fun to get a gift when it's uh, when it's European. No, <laughs> when it's when it's from a subscriber. I've never gotten a gift from a subscriber ever in my whole year and some time on YouTube. I've never received a gift from a subscriber. Well, that's because I don't put my address out there. But I I trust Claire. She's very sweet. So now I don't have a box cutter anymore. So I'm going to use these scissors to carefully cut into this box which is very heavily taped which I'm glad and it says it says by air mail and this is par avion par avion and it says royal mail it feels so special it says royal um, it says fragile I think I'm going to have oh boy did she she really tape this really well it's like I feel like I should be doing my graveyard girl imitation slicing slicing yes I'm trying to slice through this box I think do I have it open I think I have it open I have yikes is there a lot of tape on this and I see some bubble wrap and she said that she was going to reuse the box that I sent her, which is good, you know, reuse, recycle, save the earth. I think I got it open. I think I got it open. It smells like candy. I wish you guys could see me opening this, but... Ah. Okay. All right, so I have it open. I think I have it open. Kind of. Claire, you really taped this box up good. Like, really. So... Okay, I have it open. It's open! Okay, so let's see what's inside. So there is bubble wrap and then Malcolm is smelling it because there's a toy in here for him. There is, oh my God. Okay, this is so cute. You guys know how much I love Jaws, right? And I sent Claire a pocket back of uh, Jawsome. And Jaws is one of my favorite movies ever and I have two Jaws t-shirts, love the movie and everything, and now Malcolm has got his very own Jaws shark toy to play with, and he's, look, he's going to look very excited. Claire, look, he's already smelling it. Malcolm, you like the shark? He's already, he, he doesn't even, he doesn't even want me to take the tag off. He's ready to attack the toy right now. Let me see. Malcolm. Malcolm, see? Malcolm. Malcolm, say thank you to Claire. No, you don't want to say thank you. You just want to look at it. Look. Like he's just, he's attacking my hand. Are you ready to take you? Look, he wants a toy. All right. Say thank you to Claire first. All right. Well, 
he seems to like it a lot. So I'm going to cut off the tag. And this is by, it says, uh, Good Boy, Super Strong for Tuggy Fun, uh, Wild Tugs. And it's made in the UK, which always makes things seem extra, extra fancy. So I'm going to cut off this tag and I'm going to give Malcolm this toy and hopefully it'll prevent him from bothering me during future videos. There you go. Okay, so now he has his shark. He's already ready to tear it up. I feel like I should be opening this box more because it's like, it's open, but it's not open, open. I'm using my, this is my strong man face. Oh, okay. So, let's see what else. Purina Adventuros Buffalo Flavored Sticks. It says, rich in meat, low in fat. Which, that's what I wish Malcolm was. I wish he was rich in meat and low in fat, but he's not. He's a big fat so. So I am sure that he's going to love these. I've never seen these before. <laughs> Wait, I gotta show you. Hold on. Malcolm, where are you going with that? Where are you going with the shark? Where are you going with it? Okay, so back to the stuff. So we have Purina Adventuros, which I'm sure he is going to love. I would give them to him now, but he's so into the shark right at this moment. Maybe towards the end of the video, I'll give it to him. So there is, there are some wax melts, I think, or is it soap? I, I don't know. I think Claire makes soap. I'm not sure if this is a soap or if this is a wax melt. It smells like a soap. Oh, this one smells really Okay, sorry for that interrupt, uh, inter interruption. Interruption, my mother called me because I picked up Malcolm from her house. She wasn't home, she was out running errands. And then she calls me hysterical, Malcolm's missing, where has he gone? And I was like, calm down, he is with me, he is fine. She freaks out sometimes. So I'm, these are wax melts and I'm, I can't really smell them too much through the, the thing. So I'm going to open one of them up. I'll open both of them up and tell you what they smell like. This one smells a little soapy, a little like peppermint. It's like, and a little like something sweet. Hmm. I want to say it's like peppermint and, and cherry and something. Mm. It's got it's got pieces in it, so I'm going to have to melt this. This is a big piece of wax. I'm hoping it's wax and not soap. It has glitter in it. It's got glitter. You see the glitter? Okay. I feel I feel a little bit stupid because I can't tell if it's wax or if it's soap. Um. I don't know. Claire, please tell me if this is wax or if it's soap. Whatever it is, it smells really good. I don't imagine that soap bars would be that small, but it, I, I don't know. Okay, now I'm opening up the second one, second one, which has also got different pieces of stuff in it, and it's also got glitter. Oh, this one. This one smells so delicious. It smells like, oh my God, it smells so good. It smells like vanilla, like Mary Cookie from Bath and Body Works, like a vanilla cookie dough smell. And then it's almost got like a graham cracker crust. It's kind of reminds me of a s'more, like a graham cracker with a, a rich vanilla cream in it, like a cookie. And it's almost a little salty and a little caramel. Whatever this is, it smells awesome. It smells delicious. Oh, it smells so good. Okay. 
my god if if my apartment smells like that if this is wax which i think it is my apartment is going to smell like delicious pastry bakery goodness and i'm going to be tempted to go off my diet so thank you claire i love everything so far um then she sent me yankee candle car vent sticks in one of my favorite favorite scents ever and that is the black cherry so i'm definitely going to use those and there's more stuff in here. I can't believe the amount of stuff she sent me. It, it, Claire, it was not necessary, but I thank you so much. Um, so there's, it's like packed really well. <laughs> there's candy in here. There's candy, and I think there's a candle, and there's like all kinds of stuff. It's exploding everywhere. Um, oh my God, I don't know what to do first. Okay, maybe I should have done what she did and like take the stuff out of the box first and so that I wouldn't be oh my god ah oh. she is just so wonderful and it says it's a bookmark and it says to an incredible woman that is so awesome and I've just been getting back into my reading and I'm gonna read this to you but it's gonna make me cry now it says to an incredible woman always remember all the things you have to offer and all the beauty you encompass within your magnificent character. You are rich in talent and ambition, shining in every endeavor you embark upon. You extend your generosity and kindness to everyone you encounter, spreading such positive energy through your gentle actions. I swear, she's gonna make me cry. Thank you, Claire. It says, all of this has created this amazing woman you have always been and will continue to be. May each day bring you great joy. I'm not gonna get emotional. Okay. <laughs> good luck with that so wow so she sent me these amazing owl salt and pepper shakers can you see them I want to take them out of the box so that I can stop crying over that really wonderful bookmark that wow like the nicest thing ever so all right, so she sent me these owl salt and pepper shakers because she knows I love owls. Can you tell? Can you see my owl? Can you see my owl back there? And there's another owl below him. <laughs> these are so sweet looking. These are gonna be perfect for the fall, but you know I'll use them all year round. These are so wonderful. I'm. You know what? I don't even know if I wanna use them as salt and pepper shakers. I kind of wanna put them on my shelf behind me just so that I can see them in every video. You know what let me see how can you see them best I might use them for decoration for a little bit just so I can see them all the time can you guys see them there whoa there goes my camera I'm just gonna leave them there temporarily so I can look at them and enjoy them and then I'm going to put them on my kitchen table so that when I have my meals uh, I will be able to enjoy them even more but look at them they're so adorable okay so then she sent me a bunch of candy, which is good because she knows that I'm diabetic, but sometimes I crave a little something sweet. So these are, these are lollipops. I'm trying to read what they say, but I can't, they say lollies on them. They say something lollies. They have cute little characters on them. I can't read what that word says on top because I'm blind as a bat. So hopefully those will, I'm sure those will be quite tasty. Then these are Fruity Pops. I think it says Switzels. Switzels Fruity Pops. So there are those. Ooh. And then these are drumsticks. 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 I kind of want to eat one of these on camera just to see what they taste like because you know what I'm always craving something sweet and now that I've got my composure back these are gonna be like gummy candies that pull your teeth out which I love if I don't know if you guys have Mary Jane's in not Mary Jane like marijuana but the candy Mary Jane in um, England but it's like a peanut butter flavored gummy candy and this kind of reminds me of a Mary Jane. Now I have like paper stuck to my fingers. Okay, so I I don't know what flavor this is, but just by smelling it, <clears throat> I 
it tastes like strawberry and banana very yummy thank you Claire don't want to chew with my mouth open on camera then she sent me it was really good two votives from Yankee Candle in Beach Walk just the type of scent I like fresh oceany beachy it smells like fresh air oh wonderful amazing I have a little beach there with the flip-flops and then there's yet more stuff there's and it's in owl paper how well does she know me is this not the cutest wrapping paper you have ever seen in your life I don't know which I should open should I open the little present that's jingly or should I open the big present or should I open the candle there's looks like there's a candle I want to open the candle what candle could she have sent me do they make a giant version of snap peas paper care care Claire what candle have you sent me it's packed in bubble wrap and Malcolm is smelling the bubble wrap oh it's a Yankee candle it smells green it is green but I can't okay so she sent me and it's in I know they sell this in the United States but the UK one says a passion for fragrance and this is in the floral category she sent me garden hideaway which smells amazing it smells I don't want to say exactly like snap peas it smells very green and similar wonderful perfect you know me so well Claire so nice and wonderful and green this this has got a weird bottom to it I I don't know I don't it says product of the USA but it has like it has like a warning thing on it I don't think they put these on the bottom of Yankee candles here in the US that little warning thing that must be uh, to the UK I wonder if the Yankee candles from the UK have a better throw than the the ones here in the United States now you know Claire even though I love you I'm going to give this an honest review so if it has no scent throw I'm gonna to have to tell people but I'm sure I'll love it okay now the jingly package jingly okay jingly 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 and there's another thing in here this video is gonna be like 10 hours long uh, let me see here there's a little box in what what looks like a piece of jewelry but I don't know it's oh my god okay just hold on a second okay I had to get a visual aid you you guys remember this that the bad enabler gave me for my birthday this gorgeous Betsy Johnson handbag which I just today started using okay just this morning started using this bag she sent me Betsy Johnson earrings and they are adorable she sent me bows which are gorgeous and she sent me little skulls with pink bones in the hair I am wearing these tomorrow with my Betsy Johnson bag these are awesome thank you Claire and then there's yet more stuff which I cannot believe I gotta open it up it's in this pretty bag with little butterflies on it and this is Betsy Johnson too Claire you really you went overboard you did not have to do this this is like so much stuff it is a Betsy Johnson um, bracelet right it's a Betsy Johnson bracelet and it has all little like charms and things I'm trying to see if it stretches I don't want to break it because I know I want to unhook it to try it on but so so adorable look it's got like lips and like looks like almost like a 
a disco ball, kind of like diamond thing. And it's got a heart that says Betsy Johnson. It's got a little whistle. So, so pretty. I'm going to wear that with my earrings and my handbag. I'm sure I'm going to get tons of compliments at work. So, then I could be like, if, if they say to me, oh, who gave you that, you know, where'd you get that bracelet? I'm going to be like, my super cool friend who lives in England sent this to me special. Okay. I think I am on the last box. I didn't even, I didn't finish eating my, my thing. Malcolm is staring at me. It's from Yankee Candle. I swear she's a mind reader. I swear. I just did. Did I not just do a candle video the other day that I uploaded called... I had a little thing on the... Um, on the thumbnail that said how to love your candles or love your candles and it was all about candle care and what did she send me? She sends me love your candle and these are candle tools. If I had gotten this yesterday I could have put it in my video or the day before or whatever but it's here now. Yay! So this is it has an Illuma lid which is super cute a wick trimmer and a candle snuffer. So now I can, now in addition to using my, my wick trimmer that I have from Yankee Candle, it's, it's all covered in wax. It's always good to have a backup. I, it's always good to have an extra Illumilid, which I'm, I'm glad that she sent this to me. And then the candle snuffer, I'm most excited about because now I can see which is better. I can do, you know, the wick dipper versus the candle snuffer. I don't know which one you use, Claire. I'm kind of interested to know. So put a comment down below which one, you know, you prefer. I have never seen this set before. And then it says handy tools to love your candle for longer. Okay, so let's see. This is the Illuma lid. Look how cute that is. And it says Yankee Candle. And then there's the wick trimmer, which actually looks different than the one that I have. The one that I have, it's got like the half moon on either side, like it's the same on both sides. But this one, it's different. It's got like a straight edge and it's got like a curvy edge. So now that my, actually the, my candle, my wick trimmer is all covered in wax and crap, I am going to be needing a new one soon and I'm going to be trying out my lovely one that you sent me, Claire. And then I've seen these before and I've seen them in like in like old movies, like the candle snuffer where you put this over the flame and it just snuffs out the candle. I am so interested on using, on using this, in using this because I wanna see um, how it works. Look at it. And I'm going to, uh, I'll do a review. And I'll do a review of the candle and the wax cubes that she sent me and all this kind of good stuff that I can review. I want to give Malcolm, Malcolm is kind of panting because it's really hot here. Um, I want to give him one of the, oh, he's up now. Sorry, my uh, camera cut off for a second. So I was saying I want to give these to Malcolm and he's already, he's sitting right, he's standing right there, right there and he's looking for, look, he's, all right, so I'm going to, they smell like a dog would like them. They, they do smell meaty. They smell meaty. Let me, um, this is not something that I would eat, <laughs> thankfully, but let me show Malcolm and see what he does with it. These are, this is what they look like. They're, oh, they're bendy. He likes these. They're the chewy, chewy ones instead of the ones that are super hard. So now I'm going to show, we're going to see what Malcolm thinks. You ready? Malcolm. What is it? Is it good? You want it? He, he's interested. He's just like, I'm gonna put it over here because if I'm if I'm holding it, he doesn't want to be interested. But if I put it on the floor, he'll be interested. You can do it. 
doing? He's blowing boogers on me. Okay, I'll take it away if you don't want it. You want it? Now, see, if I take it away, now all of a sudden, now he wants it. He's like, give me that. Okay, so I think it was a success. Oh, by the way, see that thing on the floor? That is not a giant duty. That is a piece of a bone. Let me just throw that out there. Okay, so that was everything that was in the box. It was amazing, outstanding, incredible. Thank you so much, Claire, from the bottom of my heart. I truly, truly appreciate it. It's just, I don't know, spectacular. Just fabulous and spectacular, as are you. You are wonderful. Thank you so much for all these gifts. Um, I hope everyone out there in YouTube land enjoyed watching this video. Um, I'm going to link to Claire's channel in the description box. I'll also link to my giveaway to her and her unboxing so you can check out that. And um, that's it. I'm going to start enjoying my new gifts and reviewing them. So until next time, uh, you know, comment, rate, subscribe. Goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land. Hi, I'm back. I left something out. I am a, a bird brain. Oh, by the way, I figured out how to put the bracelet on. There it is. I'm wearing it. It's lovely. Lovely, lovely. Okay. Very cool. Gorgeous. Um, she sent me a card. Oh, dope. I mean, I, I missed it in the box, but I found it. She sent me a card. Now watch. It's going to make me cry again. The most gorgeous card ever. Amazing. So cute. And then on the back, something fell out of it. A note fell out. And it says, I'm, look, I'm reading, looking at the back because it says Splendidos. Splendidos. This is the most gar gorgeous card I think I've ever gotten. It's like art. I want to frame it. I think I will frame it. It is just beautiful. Look at that. It's like it's owl art. Oh, it says, dear, and then she uses my actual name, but we'll say Scent Maven. Dear Scent Maven, thank you so much for the wonderful box of Bath and Body Works goodies. You are so very sweet and kind and thoughtful. I'm pleased we are friends. Indeed we are, Claire. I hope you enjoy your parcel. You deserve some nice treats also. Thank you. It says love and best wishes from across the pond. And it's signed Claire. And then it says dear Malcolm, Jake has included a couple of gifts for you. We hope you enjoy them. And he is very much enjoying them. Thank you, Jake. You did a great job picking out presents. He is going to get fat as a pig eating the wonderful treats that you sent him. And he's already playing with the shark as you saw. So great great choices there and the card is did I say the card was amazing it's amazing I need to say it again oh <laughs> and this would have been helpful before this would have been helpful before when I was trying to figure out is it a wax cube is it a soap bar she actually has a note in here that explains what this is so thank you because I'm you know out there it says the two wax chunks so they are indeed wax um, are from sassy girl aroma in the USA to melt in your warmer thank you um, so this one that I thought was peppermint is actually Macintosh apple and warm vanilla sugar it, to me it smells like like peppermint and now no but now now that I smell it again because I thought it was cherry and now I do smell the apple I do smell the apple and the sugar now. I don't know why I was thinking peppermint. And this one is called Serendipity in the Kitchen, the blue and brown. And this, I just want to eat the wax. I just want to just, mm, it's just delicious, delicious. And Malcolm, look, Malcolm, he's already over there looking for more treats. There are the treats. Here's the card. Here's the treats. And he's already looking. He wants more. Okay, so again, now it's, it's even more spectacular with the card. I am going to frame that card. Now, oh, do you see this? I'm going to frame the card and I'm going to put it back there on my shelf. I'm going to find a frame. I know they have this size frame in um, Michael's. This is like, is this 12 by 12 or 
eight by eight or something like that. So he, he, he's eating, he wants to eat the treats through the bag. Stop it. I'm gonna frame this. I'm gonna put it back there. Okay, <laughs> now for the, now that's, I think that's, we've come to an end. Thank you again, Claire. Uh, I already said goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land before, but I'll say it again. Bye guys, see you next time.